A rivalry is reborn as the Eagles come east down Commonwealth Avenue on a Sunday afternoon to start a new season series against the Terriers. Ursoy back behind the net to recollect. Shaughnessy up top, one time drive from Matini and she scores! Matini straight through on the one timer, a power play goal for the Terriers less than two minutes in. Alex with a goal and two assists in five appearances. Rebound right out front, the Terriers score again! Emma Wathrich. Alderoni is there. Poulem is covering. And that might have been a hook, but instead it's going to lead to a breakaway for Di Fiore. Di Fiore is shut down. Rebound goes in. And she scores on the rebound. It has been a fun start to this one, especially the way BU started. Right out in front. Shot and scores. From the point, it's Sydney Fess. Pinch. Michael towards the net by Shaughnessy. Shaughnessy down low. Fun to see. Centering feed. Parker scores. Shaughnessy with her third assist of the game for McKenna Parker. Backhand feed. And now we go to four on four. As it's Crowley Cahill barreling down. Centering pass. Tripped up. Score. And then barreling into the boards after the game tying goal of the Eagles. Yeah, I think it's been as much about anything. Looked out here, two on one. Vote into the circle, she scores! What a shot from Christina Vote, bar down, and the Terriers retake the lead once more. So it's possibly didn't see what happened, but it was in front of the net. Yeah, five on three here for the full two minutes. All day for the Eagles to score, and they do. Kelly Brown on the doorstep, baseballs it into the net. And it was 3-2, 3-3. 4 3, 4 4. Here we are. Korea to the middle. Korea scores! Courtney Korea gives the Terriers the lead again with 3.47 to go. Up to the point. Cross ice. Crowley Cahill puts it on net. Shanahan made the save. The puck is loose. And who blew? I thought I heard a whistle. We're going to play on. Definitely heard a whistle. It came from one of the officials way behind the play, and I think that's going to be it. I mean, they just completely ignored it, and maybe rightfully so, the puck wasn't There tracked. shouldn't have been a whistle yet.